Hey everyone, this 365 Ninja tip is about setting up a meeting in Outlook 2013. This is the most basic way to do it. You're in your calendar tab, go to new meeting, and you can fill out the fields from there. The reason I said new meeting instead of new appointment is that new appointment doesn't automatically add the to field in order to send your meeting to additional attendees. If you do click new appointment instead of new meeting, you can click invite attendees and get that to field. Now there's another way to start a meeting. And this is actually my preferred method because I like to be looking at my calendar and see the week laid out in front of me. You can click and drag in a time frame, select new meeting, and your time will be filled in for you. So I prefer that just so that I know exactly what I'm scheduling over or around. So now I can enter the email address for the person I want to invite to my meeting and I'll go ahead and enter the rest of the meeting details. Outlook 2013 offers a lot of configuration options for meetings, much like it does for email messages. And in this video, I'm not going to go through each and every one of them, but please feel free to check back with 365ninja.com for more, or find me on social channels and ask me your question. Hope this quick video helped you get started with creating meetings. Thanks.